this one is on graphing the linear equation in two variables. Again, the graph of any linear equation in two variables is a straight line. Since the graph of a linear equation in two variables is a straight line, we only need to plot two points to determine the line. However, it is better to plot a third point to verify. So we're going to graph the linear equation x minus 3y is equal to 6. If a x is equal to negative 3, x is equal to 0, and x is equal to 3. So if we compute this, we will be able to get uh, we will be able to get three points that we can plot on the graph. So let's start computing with the first value. You have x minus 3y is equal to 6. We will replace x with negative 3. So that will be negative 3 minus negative 3. Uh, negative 3y is equal to 6. I mean negative 3 minus 3y is equal to 6. This is constant. We need to move it to the other side. So we will be left with negative 3y is equal to 6. If this is negative and you put it on the other side, it will become positive. Okay? So negative 3y is equal to 6 plus 3 is 9. Negative 3 and 9 are divisible by negative 3. So we divide this by negative 3. We also divide this by negative 3. This will cancel out. You will be left with y. And then 9 divided by negative 3 will result to negative 3. So if x is negative 3, your y is negative 3. So we're done with the first one. Let's substitute 0 for x. So you have x minus 3y is equal to 6. x will be 0 minus 3y is equal to 6. Negative 3y is equal to 6. We divide it by negative 3 so we can get the value of y. This will cancel out so you will be left with y. 6 divided by negative 3 is negative Two. So if x is 0, y is equal to negative 2. Now, for the last one, what if x is equal to 3? x minus 3y is equal to 6. We will substitute 3 for this one. So 3 minus 3y is equal to 6. We move this to the other side. So negative 3y is equal to 6. Positive, it will become negative here. And then, negative 3y is equal to 6 minus 3 is 3. We have to remove this, so let's divide it by negative 3. Of course, you do it on the other side as well. This will can cancel out, so you have y is equal to 3 divided by negative 3 is negative 1. So, if x is equal to 3, y is equal to negative 1. With the computation that we had earlier, that means that we can have three sets of ordered pair. So you have negative 3 and negative 3. This one is 0 and negative 2. And then this one is 3 and negative 1. Now, we can plot these points on the Cartesian plane and then connect them with a straight line. Alright, so with this Cartesian plane, let's plot negative 3 and negative 3. So that's 3 units to the left, 1, 2, 3, and 3 units going down, 1, 2, 3. So this is your first point. Now you have 0 and negative 2. So your x is 0, your y is negative 2, 1, 2. So this is your second point. And then you have 3 and negative 1. So you go 3 units to the right, 1, 2, 3, and then 1 unit going down. So this is your third point. And then we connect this with a straight line. 
as straight as it can get. And this is the graph of our linear equation. x minus 3y is equal to 6.